Hey guys, it's me Meta and I just came back from school and I am going to be making slime today. So this is the slimes that I made today. So I made this orange slime. So I put some sand in this and it looks really cool and it feels really cool. 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 So, now I am going to play with my, so this is my purple one. It's not really that stretchy. So, the slime that I'm going to be making today is soap slime. So, all you need for this is... Soap and salt. So I'm going to put my soap in here in this little tub. So there, there's that. And then I'm going to take my salt, put a little bit in there, and then I'm going to put some in my hand. And then I'm just going to mix it. So it looks and uh, feels like slime kind of. And then I'm just gonna put a little bit more soap in. And the tiniest bit of salt. And then I'm going to mix it up and then it goes back to the way it was. And then I'm going to take some saline solution. Saline from Tesco. Taking the solution, and I'm going to take my spoon, two drops of it on there, and then pour it in there. I'm going to add another two and pour it in there. Mix it up so it's not really turning like slime. So now I'm just going to put more soap in, then put it in the freezer for about. 30 minutes, something, mix it all up, so don't put too much salt in because then it won't like activate it, but if you make loads then put loads of salt in it. So now I'm just going to go and pop this in the freezer for about 30 minutes, so I will be 2 minutes. So there is my first slime and it is in the freezer and I wait till I have finished mine. So, and also this is the slime that I also made. It's tiny and it's in the biggest tub that my guy got. And like it's not really stretchy like my purple one, but it's really cool. And it does take you a few days to make it set. So all that I added was glue. So this is fluffy shaving foam. And so this is my shaving foam here. My glue is here. So then I just added some of that ingredients. Then I added some saline solution. Then I left it for about a week in this tub. And then I, and then it turned out to be like this. So this is the slime so far. So there, that is in the tub. So maybe I, if I get three, no, two hundred likes on this video, I will do a giant slime challenge. And I will make so much slime. So I've just got a big tub here and I've just put some salt in it. Because I don't know why, but I just wanted to. So also this is a slime that I made before this video. And it's not turned out to slime yet. So I have to leave it for two days. And then it'll be slime. So... 
Today I am going to be going to netball and I'm not really happy because last week I got kicked out of the team and then I got put back in here because one of them left. And then I, no, tell a lie, that wasn't me, that was my friend. And then she left and then I got, and then I feel so sorry for her so this is her last day at netball and then she's gonna be gone. So I just added some sand in this because I really wanted it to be like, I don't know. But it's very sticky if you leave it on places but it's not on your hands because look, I leave it on there for a bit. See, it's not sticky at all. And then I just put some more saline solution in the tub because this makes it less sticky and I need to make it less sticky. But don't add too much in because then it won't like actually turn into slime and it'll just do that. So I think I've added a bit too much in, but what I'm gonna do, a little tiny bit of soap because this is not soap slime at all. This is just like ordinary soap. So I mix all of this in and on my next video I will so on this I mean on this video I will be making so our next slime is play-doh slime so all you need for this one is I need to find my play-doh because I don't know not where I put it but my art box is right here so it should be some in the art box Okay, so this is my slime that I made ages ago. And it's actually like turned into slime, kind of. So I'm just gonna take my paintbrush and like mix it all up. And then it's kind of turned into slime. So this is the blue slime that I made before, but it didn't actually work. So I'm more soap. And I, this is fluffy slime. Like the, my blue fluffy slime, but this one didn't work because I added too much activator in. So that didn't work. So now I'm going to find my play doh and then we will we'll make a play doh slime. I just need to find it though. So my box is like literally right next to my film. This is really hard to open. So here, here's my Play-Doh. I've got yellow Play-Doh. So I'm going to be making Play-Doh slime. So all you need for this slime is Play-Doh and some pen soap. So you can take some Play-Doh out. So you start kneading it. And then you're going to add, you're not supposed to add saline solution, but on my, all my Play-Doh slimes, I add saline solution, but I only add like a drop. So there, I've added my drop, and then I'm just gonna like I've added too much in there. Mix it all in. So we'll add the hand soap in a minute. I'll just mix it all this in because this like makes it more stretchier. So this is neon yellow. It's very bright, but the camera's in a really dark room. So I'm in the like back room now, and it is really dark in here. So you're just gonna add your hand soap or lotion, whatever you have, but as long as you like use it for your hands, it's fine. So then you're just gonna mix it all up and then it will get all over your hands and it will get your in your fingers and it might sting you. So once you've mixed it and you keep mixing it, you want to add a little bit of salt. 
And then so you like you want to make like fingerprints like that, and then add your salt in. So add my salt in, and I'm gonna add raw soap. So my soap comes out really like big. So after this, I'm gonna have to wash my hands because I'm gonna get soap all over my hands. As you can see, I have. This is not good. So it goes really smooth, the Play-Doh, and if you want to make it fluffy, add shaving foam. So I'm going to add shaving foam, cream, shaving cream, and then now I'm going to mix it in, because you don't want it, so if you want it to be fluffy, this is what you do. You can also like get a ball of plate to make your slime in, but I don't have a ball of plate. I have a tons of balls, but take your some. So it's been about ten minutes, five minutes or something. So this is your slime. See how stretchy it goes, kind of. And then if you want, you can like leave it for a bit. But I'm going to add a little bit of salt and a little bit of soap and leave that just to sink in and we will wait till tomorrow and see what happens. I'm just going to mix it in so that that should be fine. So now, we are, so I'm going to go and check the other side. This has gone really, really, really cold. So it looks a lot like slime. But it hasn't really like set out like I was supposed to. Because probably I haven't let it in too like, not long. And I was going to have to link pollution, but you're not supposed to. But on my other one that I made, I like, so this is a soap slime. And it actually worked. So I added that well, after we're doing. So I'm just gonna put loads of salt in. Made a pile of salt. Now I'm gonna put this back. So there, and then I'm just gonna put that in there for a bit. And then I'm going to leave it till tomorrow. Like I'm going to take it out, leave it till tomorrow, and then we'll do another video in the morning and see what happens. So yeah, but we're not finished yet because I found this slime that I made before, but I don't know if it worked. I think it gone watery, but we will we'll have a look. It looks watery. It actually feels like slime. Slime. It like actually like feels like slime, but we're gonna add some salt in, and then we'll add some activator in, and then we'll mix this up. So it feels like slime, so it's getting tough and, and tougher as you go, but you do get it on your fingers, so. You have to be like really careful with it. And then what you're gonna do, you're gonna add some soap, some salt, some salt, some of this, some of this, and then you're just gonna leave the lid on for it. Not mix it in at all. Leave the lid on it. Leave it till the morning, and then see what it looks like. So that's the sound I made. So thank you guys for watching this video and bye!